tonight in Brackenridge, a vigil for their fallen police chief. People coming together to remember the life of Justin McIntyre and to remember the impact he had on their community. KDK's Lauren Linder is live in Brackenridge with more tonight. Lauren. Ken, a memorial continues to grow here at the Brackenridge Police Department as the community shows their love for their chief. Tonight, they also honored him at a vigil just a few blocks away. A song and a prayer. None of us could foresee what was going to happen this week, but here we are, my friends. For Brackenridge Police Chief Justin McIntyre. And he dedicated his life in service to who we are. As hundreds of people from the community and beyond paid their respects to the fallen police chief, shot and killed in the line of duty on Monday, Mayor Lindsay Frazier. There are truly few people in this entire world who were more genuine and kind than our chief. And former police chief Jamie Bach. This is one of the hardest things that I ever had to do shared just how much McIntyre meant to their borough. Bach having known him since he was a young boy. He was always professional, dedicated, hardworking, sensitive to the residents of Brackenridge, a role model for our children, and a valuable asset to our community. McIntyre spent 22 years of his life as a police officer, four as chief, dedicated to giving back to the small borough where he was born and raised. He's the pillar of this community, he really is. The surrounding communities as well, all love and respect him. He was a good chief and uh, did his job very well and kept our community very safe. Now those he supported all these years will do the same for his family and fellow officers. We all love them while making sure his legacy lives on. I don't want this senseless, heinous, evil act to define us or to destroy the good that he spent his life protecting and building. This tragedy will not define us, and if anything, it will propel us to be the best we can ever be. I talked to the Tarentum officer also shot on Monday at the funeral at the vigil. He tells me that he's doing OK. He and the rest of the community will say their final goodbyes to the chief next week. If you take a look at your screen right now, these are the details. Visitation will be held on Monday and Tuesday and the funeral will be held on Wednesday. For now, reporting live in Brackenridge, Lauren Linder, Kitty K News.